Hey y'all, I wanted to talk about why um, it's important for skincare, like a skincare routine. So um, first off, thank you so much for tuning in and my channel will be pretty much where we talk about preservatives, natural ingredients, of course, Ashe Botanica, but you know, our products and food. And um, we're just gonna be talking about this holistic healing because it's a thing y'all, like it is magic in the herb garden. Um, first off, I do want to talk about what Ashe means, and it is a Yoruba word, uh, and that's like a uh, Nigeria, you know, African uh, type of religion and people, and they believe in Orishas, their gods, and if I say it wrong, please correct me, um, uh, because it is actually really kind of hard to learn, uh, like, the actual history or, like, more about, um, the actual religion because it's all by word of mouth which is really cool um so you actually have to go to somebody who knows what they're talking about mm. so uh yeah the word means um like power and um blessings like yes i speak this into into existence and that is about manifestation as uh, manifestation excuse me as well and what that means is I will be great, just like that. You know, you guys know the TikTok, like I am wealthy, I am healthy, I'm gonna drink water, I'm not gonna do that probably. But if you say that you won't, you won't, because you actually believe that you won't. Does that make sense? And if you do, you will, because you believe that you can and will. Hmm, yeah, little, little trick for the mind there, but it's all about how we feel um, and if we believe that we can actually do something, we will. And I think a little piece of us inside is like, yeah, that's true because it is, it's like, come on, gather yourself. Um, so relax and take it down. So um, let's talk about why skincare is important. Like, why do you need a skincare routine? Well, everybody has different skin. And you shed skin on a daily basis. Uh, you know, that's why you wash your covers and stuff, right? So, uh, you, you, you gotta have a skincare routine. <laughs> it's probably best. Why? Because you actually can prevent, uh, like, aging, uh, acne breakouts. Uh, you know, you can kind of catch some problems before it gets down the road and you start looking like a banana, you know, or... I don't know, raisins or something that you find behind the couch. Like, let's not spit you. We don't, maybe we don't need Botox if we just take care of ourselves now. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's like kind of using like sunscreen so you don't, you know. So that's why you definitely need. So, how do you know like what to use on your face? Uh, well, it depends on what type of skin you have. And if you have oily skin, because we're going to talk about how many of them, there are five, right? There's oily skin, and that's usually a excess amount of sebum. Like right, I'm gonna look at myself now. I'm gonna right here, the T zone, right? Um, and it's you're gonna have enlarged pores, right? I have some right here, and um, you you probably are prone to develop acne because where there's oil, there's bacteria, and that can lead to infections, and the rest is a pimple. So. <laughs> Uh, that's oily skin pretty much. The T-zone, large pores, and uh, probably you're gonna get some acne. Now, dry skin, dull, flaky, sometimes even like scaly. Don't, no judging, but I just, I don't like the feeling. <laughs> I have combination skin, so I know what it feels like. Um, so, you know, it gets re really tight after you wash your face. Um, maybe you have some visible lines or wrinkles and it can become itchy and irritated. You have dry skin. Uh, normal skin, because we don't like you guys, but whatever. Uh, balanced, right? It's not dry or oily. Um, it's not prone to acne breakouts, whatever. Um, and it's not sensitive, uh, and it doesn't really react to much, you know, normal size pores, you know, the works, they're beautiful, whatever. Um, now, combination skin, since the majority of us probably have that, 
um, dry and oily. And uh, in the areas of like the T-zone, it is T-zone, T-zone. It is usually oily. And um, your cheeks, they're probably dry and flaky. This sounds like me. And uh, you know, really, your face just, it, it, you just can't never like hydrate it or uh, it's just never enough for combination skin. I'll just say that much because I got some dry patches right now and I'm not too proud, but what can I do, eh, jeans? So uh, sensitive skin, which my mother personally has sensitive skin and I, so I know what it can be kind of scary. Um, I've heard stories about people using new products and then they wake up and their face is like sizzling. You know, that's too much. You know, that's too much. You're sensitive. Um, and what the thing about sensitive is, is you can be sensitive oily, sensitive dry, sensitive normal. Um, and the thing about it is, is the redness. So some people might have um, you know, a little rosacea, you know, or, you know, like if they wax something too hard, they can, uh, have red irritation, you know, instead of just like the puffiness from regular waxing. Um, see, it's tight, uh, and it can get itchy sometimes. Yeah. Triggered by, uh, external, like, irritants, like parabens, uh, pollution, dyes, fragrances. You can't use any of that stuff. You most likely have sensitive skin and I'm I apologize because you have to really find the product that works for you and sometimes they're a little bit expensive not sorry really oh I feel for you guys um but it's okay I'm here <laughs> so yeah <clears throat> but there's a 30 minute test you can take you just use a gentle cleanser on your face and you wait 30 minutes. So now if your face feels, you just, you know, pat dry and you're gonna wait 30 minutes. And if your face feels uh, oily or, or shiny, like in the T-zone here, uh, you probably have oily skin. Uh, and if it's tight or dry, you probably have dry skin, right? Uh, and kind of, it might get a little ashy <laughs> or flaky. <laughs> Sorry, uh, but that's what moisturizer is for. Uh, so uh, T-zone shine and like, you know, maybe your cheeks are a little dry cause that's me, combination, that's you, winning team. And uh, that's pretty much it there. Yeah, and if, it, if you don't feel anything, cause like we have to talk about normal skin people cause you know, they need skincare routine too or whatever. Um, you are probably, have normal skin if you can wash your face and put nothing on it and it's not too oily it's not tight it's not dry you have normal skin and congratulations because the rest of us probably are like whatever with our acne and whatever um but i do want to tell you guys that all the support that i've had so far is so amazing and i really just cannot believe um yes i can <laughs> I'm sorry, manifestation, because I said it would be, and it is. And the power in our words, because we always say that there are power in our words, there is. Really take the time to believe in yourself and show confidence in yourself. That's sexy, really, honestly. And um, it's something about it. When you actually believe in yourself and how it spreads to another person and all you have to do is just look in the mirror and see what you see and love that and say i do love me i am going to be i will be and things will start to change i promise you have to talk to yourself we have a lot of negative thoughts that flow through our mind all day, every day, when we sleep, when we awake, you know what I'm saying? And you might as well just go ahead and start a new habit of saying something good and positive to yourself. Um, I hope I answer some of your questions. I'll leave the link down uh, in the description box for my Etsy shop and I'm so happy um, to just have a channel. I just can't believe I'm doing this. But like I said, I can because I will and I am. 
that, sis. <laughs> Now it wants to work. <laughs> now you want to work like after I'm done? Like, okay. I'll see you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Share away because we'll be talking about some deep, interesting things, ingredients, and recipes, how to feel beautiful and confident, and more. Thank you guys for tuning in.